So you guys, I've done a lot of sports team like custom. So today, what I'm doing is NBA versus NFL custom. So I've done a couple of NFL team customs. I did a couple of NBA customs. So I need y'all to pick down below what is your favorite sports team custom that I have done. I've done a couple, so I kind of did like a compilation and I actually changed it up just a little bit. So you guys, with all that being said, hopefully you enjoy today's video. Hopefully you sit back, relax, eat some snacks, and let's go. Let's do this. So you guys, the very, very first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take out these shoe strings. I'm going to take them out, get them out of there. Before we start painting the shoe, you already know we have to prep. We have to take that factory finish off the shoe, so we acetone in the whole shoe. So you guys, this is the very first shoe I'm doing, this custom. So, already by the yellow, y'all have an idea of who I'm going with. This is actually the West too, by the way. This is the West. Guess it right now. Put it in the comment section right now. Okay, now I'm doing the orange. So you guys, you already know my very first pick for the West gotta be the Suns. Let's go Suns to the day you die, Valley Boys. We the Valley Boys. I think the Suns are gonna run it back. I really do think they're going to CP3 going crazy right now. I think they're going to run it all the way back. Going they're going to be in the finals. So the overall thing for this custom for the Phoenix Suns is I was mimicking their like away in the valley. I said in the valley, the valley um, jerseys they have. So that's why I did like the gradient right there. Did that little airbrush, but now I'm about to paint it black. And I'm just going for that away jersey, the valley. I might put it up on the screen for you so y'all can see it. Not gonna lie cp3 is putting on an amazing performance again yo did you see how he closed out that pelican series yo he killed it and i mean he went 14 for 14 yo that is perfect let me tell y'all that is perfect like how he shot the ball 14 for he didn't miss a shot and he ended it out where he started at he started new orleans and he got him out of there hey look man the sun's tough devin booker DeAndre Aiden. I mean, if, if I had to choose any other team that may make it to the um, finals from the West, it has to be maybe be Golden State because they're pretty tough too. But I'm going with the Suns on this one. Okay, so after I paint that part black, I'm gonna paint this top part purple, you know, cause they got like a purple trim around the jerseys. And that's basically what I'm going for. It's just like a very similar uh, custom that goes with the jerseys. guys if i paint the top of this tongue tag purple just to complement just so the colors can start going with each other and now i'm about to actually paint this air part um just give it a little bit more detail you know what i'm saying a little bit more detail So 
So this is what's gonna tie all the customs together is the stencils. I got sun stencil and I got the valley um, stencil. And this right here is gonna make the custom look sweet. And basically I do all my stencils myself. Um, I got my own machine and I do it myself so I don't have to really like go out and pay for any other ones. So you guys, the first step I'm gonna do is take out the laces. We gotta take these laces out and put them to the side before we start prepping. So you guys, the next step I'm gonna do is basically prep the leather and this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take the acetone here and I'm gonna take like a cotton ball and basically I'm just rubbing the parts that I am painting to take the factory finish off. Basically what this does, it helps the paint really stick to the, like bonds really to the leather. And that's why you have to do it, it's very key. So you guys, the first shoe I'm gonna do is actually do the Bengals Custom. Um, you already know, go with Joe. But um, yeah, I'm gonna do the Bengals Custom. I'm starting off with the orange. And I actually had to mix this orange up with like orange, red, and like uh and white it was like orange red and white um sometimes you have to play around with the colors you know what i'm saying to give it that exact orange um well the exact well you get what i'm saying the exact color basically is that's what you want to do you want to kind of just mix the paints up just so you can try to get that perfect color So you guys, the next step I'm gonna do is basically paint some parts black. Um, that's just gonna give it like the whole bingo steam. And basically I used a uh, flat black for this.
next thing I'm gonna do is basically paint this Jumpman logo. So I have like a very, very thin uh, paintbrush here. And I may actually switch over to the toothpick too because it, I mean, both of them goes hand in hand and both work. So I'm just taking my time, just going over the Jumpman and just giving it that extra detail. As you can see now, I took out the um, toothpick just to, um, I mean, they're both easy to, to use. It's just, I just wanted to get take out the toothpick just to um, do it. know the first thing we gotta do we gotta take them shoe strings up out of them shoes you know what i'm saying that's the first thing you gotta do before customizing <laughs> So you guys, you already know the next thing we have to do is prep the shoes. That's the next step. So that's why we got the acetone here. We got the cotton rounds. Make sure you take off the factory finish off the shoes. So after we prep, now it's time to paint. I'm actually gonna start with the warrior shoe first. You already know, go dubs. No, I'm just playing. No, I'm a Miami Heat fan. You know what I'm saying? Y'all already know that. But I'm going to start off with the Warriors custom first. You know what I'm saying? So basically, I'm painting this part blue. I'm painting like the upwards blue. And then I'm going to do some color blocking later. While I'm painting this shoe, I'm just thinking like, yo, the Warriors have been to the finals a lot of times recently. You know what I'm saying? I think they said they've been to the finals, I think like six times. Like, yo, that's a dynasty. Do y'all agree that the Warriors are dynasty? I think they are, but they didn't three-peat though. That's the thing. But we all know if KD and Clay was there, then they would have three-peated with the Raptors. But I don't know. I definitely consider them as a dynasty though, straight up. Well, then again, a dynasty is like, nah, I, nah, I would consider them a dynasty because you think about it. The Showtime Lakers, they didn't three-peat. Uh, they went back-to-back, -back, though. Uh, the Bulls are definitely a dynasty, 95-96. Um, you know, they three-peated, no problem. So, yeah, yeah, the Warriors are a dynasty. Hey guys, so now I'm about to paint like the swoosh yellow. About to paint it yellow. And um, basically, this is like, this is some color blocking I'm doing. And I had to like, the I had the colorway like in the back of my mind, but now it's more so I'm just putting it on the shoe and I'm just going with it. <laughs> Okay, you guys now it's time for the east 
all right i'm doing some blue so that already gives you a cool hint right there what i'm doing and this is my team a lot of people didn't understand or didn't know what my team is i've been watching them for a while i've been watching them since i was in middle school so already with the blue and the pink y'all already know who i'm going with you know what i'm saying miami heat fans stand up let's go you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I feel like we got a real good chance of really making it to the finals. The only team we got to watch out for is the Bucks. I think the Bucks. Now Giannis, he's a problem. He's a he's a definite problem. And um, as far as that pink, that pink wasn't the right shade, so I went and got another pink and basically went over it because I'm really going for their like their Miami Vice jerseys, their away jerseys. Um, that that's kind of what I'm going for. So, I am a LeBron fan, right? I'm a LeBron fan, but I am a Miami Heat team fan. You know what I'm saying? I've been liking them ever since, really since D-Wade, Alonzo Mourning, Shaq, uh, Antoine Walker, um, Gary Payton, Jason Williams, that whole championship team. I've been liking them ever since then, for real, since D-Wade was called a Flash. Well, he's still called a Flash, but y'all know it's it's a little different now so he got older and he retired but yeah um but yeah i've been i've been liking the heat for a while I really think Jimmy Buckets is going to lead us all the way to the finals. I think so. I really do think he's going to lead us all the way to the finals. I believe that 120%. It's going to happen. <laughs> it's going to happen. But I'm just painting over these parts black. I'm painting most of this shoe black because their main colors is that pink and that blue. And so that's basically what I'm going for. So for this shoe tag, I'm going with the pink just to complement the um the pink within already that's in the shoe. I think this came out pretty, pretty dope, to be honest. Okay, you guys, so the stencil, it really, these stencils bring the custom all together. And this is the thing. I messed up slightly on this one and the Suns, and I fixed it later, like off camera. I'm showing a little bit here, but I fixed I fixed it off camera. And all you gotta do is just paint over back over black, and just try to make it clean looking. That's that's all you have to do. So you guys, now it's time to paint this part blue. Um, this is gonna really make it the custom pop, I think, in my in my my opinion, it's gonna make it pop. I'm over there stuttering, <laughs> but yeah, it's gonna make it pop. So yeah, that's left. Next 
shoe up is the Boston Celtics shoe. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my boy Jay Z. Yeah, 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 yeah
okay guys so now we move on to the warrior stencil and this was a cool stencil i found now look now i'm gonna just be honest right here you guys is that i didn't realize that you know the yellow is going to not really appear as much because it's on a white background so i didn't know that so after i took the stencil off the shoe and i was just like man what do i do so i just decided to leave it to be honest some final touches to the shoe you know I'm, I'm actually painting the jump man and I'm doing this on the Warriors and the Celtics shoes
So you guys, there we have it. Custom Jordan 1 Lowe's Super Bowl edition is done. The Bengals and we got the Rams. Now look, I know a lot of people are gonna be in the comment section and say, Xavier, that's not like the right color blue. So as I was painting it, I didn't realize until the last minute when I looked at the logo, I was like, yo, this is not the right blue, but still though, it's still clean. 